72-year-old grandmother is opening up about how she survived being stranded for nine days in the Arizona wilderness. Emergency crews rescued Ann Rogers this weekend after she got lost on a trip to see the family. A distress sign that she made spelling out help guided searchers to her location. Benita Nyer is here with the incredible survival story. Benita, this is great news. Good morning to you. It really is. Good morning to you. Well, out of food and liquids, Rogers resorted to eating plants and drinking water from a pond. In the harsh Arizona climate, she said it dipped to freezing at night. She made a shelter and built a fire. In the end, Rogers triumphed after spending more than a week in the wild. Weak, disoriented, but alive. This was the end of Ann Rogers' remarkable journey. On a road trip to visit her grandchildren, the 72-year-old got lost. Her car ran out of gas and power, leaving her stranded on a remote stretch of the Arizona wilderness. I waited until sunup the next morning, hoping a truck, a car, anybody, anything would go by, even a steer. I didn't care. Anything alive. Traveling with her dog inside the White Mountain Apache Reservation, Rogers climbed a ridge looking for signs of life and a cell phone signal, but would come across no one for nine days. I was eating desert plants. Uh, my dog was too, diving into clover and finding all the places that were the easiest path for me to take. She was my pathfinder on that journey. The breakthrough came when rescue teams spotted this distress signal she made near an area where her dog was seen. I found an elk carcass, bleached white, long gone. Pulled that out on the sandy beach, pointed it towards a big sign that said help with an exclamation point made out of white stones and sticks. Rogers described the moment she knew she had been saved. When that helicopter, that air rescue police copter landed, I just sat down and bawled. Remarkable, remarkable, remarkable. Rogers was in fair condition when she was found, and she and her dog are both doing fine. Well enough, Nora, that she actually went for a hike Tuesday afternoon. <laughs> wow, that's incredible. She is hardy. Yeah, Grandma said, I still got stuff to do. I love that she wrote the sign help and then put an exclamation point. <laughs> so glad she's all right. And the dog, of course, is okay, too. We like that yes. a lot. Yes, thank you so Man. much, Benita. What were you going to say? A man's best friend. Yes. yes. In this case, a grandma's best friend. That's right. Yes, That's very right. nice indeed. All right.